Alright, here we go with another Hackintosh video. Um, this time I plan on uh, inst uh, Hackintosh in this Dell computer from scratch. Um, you might be familiar with this computer from one of my videos. What had happened is, being as though I built two new Hackintoshes from scratch, I went and formatted all of my Hackintosh machines and prepared them to be sold. Unfortunately, no one bought them. But uh, someone sent me an email asking me for help. So fortunately for him, I still have this Dell machine. Um, so what I'm going to do is build a Hackintosh from scratch. Um, I take that back. What I'm going to do is Hackintosh a Dell from scratch. And I'm going to do a step-by-step -step showing him what I did. Being as though he has the exact same specs on his machine as this Pentium 4 has. So let's get started. The first thing I want to start with is... Uh, the graphics card. Let's take a look at the graphics card. I think I got it upside down. Alright. Okay, I don't know if you can see that clearly. But basically, that is an AGP card. It is a 256 megabytes. It is a, a EG46200. Basically, it's an NVIDIA card. Um, I want to address something. Um, I know for a fact that uh, AGP cards and PCI Express cards work. Um, I've used NVIDIA cards for most of my Hackintoshes and they've worked flawlessly. Um, every time I get a new card it, it, it gets better and better. Um, there's not really any problems. I haven't ran into any hitches. Um, I would say if you're going to do this it's best that you have an AGP card at you know at the least um i don't hear too many things about a pci card so if it's a pci express card which is or, or basically a pci e-card then yeah that'll work also because i've used that that's i've used uh pci express in my last two machines that i built so i say go for it now let's turn this around let's take a look You see this IDE ribbon. This is connected to DVD drive. Now I wanted to uh, point this out because a lot of uh, people say when it comes to the, the Hackintosh community that uh, you need to use a, a, a SATA drive, a SATA DVD drive. And uh, I'm, proof, I'm proof that uh, I was able to install Hackintosh or, or OS X on a uh, Dell machine with the IDE DVD burner so let's go ahead and just toss it out the water um, right here it's my hard drive and that's also on ID on the IDE ribbon wait a minute hold up wrong cable either way is IDE so now that we got that out the way let's go ahead and uh, close this bad boy up and uh, start the whole process.